Hey, hey guys, it's me, Urban Gardener, the Happy Cultivator, and today we're gonna to be talking about caterpillars. I was sitting on my couch in my garage looking out the door at this nice big Brazilian Kush here, and I noticed a little something up here. Let me zoom in and see if you guys can catch it. Okay, if you look up there, let's see if I can zoom in a little bit more even, you'll see that there is a leaf right here that's starting to look a little decayed. Well, that is a classic sign of caterpillar damage and that there is a possible caterpillar even in there. So I'm gonna get up there grab my ladder, climb all the way up there, and see what we see. All right, got the ladder up here, so let's go ahead and climb on up into the trees and see what we can find up here where I spotted the damage. Oh, and here's a little bit more damage too. The, uh, yeah, there's more damage here it turns out. So the caterpillars really like it up here at the tops. They like easy access. The butterflies come in, they land on the easiest ones to get to. Well, the easiest ones to get to are gonna be your most beautiful tops. And this is why I sprayed the Bacillus thuringiensis. I found another little spot. So I'm gonna have to come up here, see how bad it is, and tear out these bad spots. What I'll do is I will come in here with some scissors and I'll cut it out. You can see what's in here. And we will search for some caterpillars while we're at it. Now the caterpillars might have already died due to the spraying of the Bacillus thuringiensis. You definitely want to be spraying BT at this time of year in my area or else you will get ravaged by caterpillars. It seems to be that I'm not finding any caterpillars and the damage is not thorough. That means that the Bacillus thuringiensis is probably doing its job. So we'll just come up here, we'll investigate the damage, we'll pull the damage off, we'll look in here and we'll find, see right here we have a caterpillar see in there you can see there's a caterpillar we'll go ahead and we'll get him out of there and we will kill the caterpillar by squeezing it and then we will clean up the damage in here with some scissors we'll investigate a little more it looks like pretty much everything else is doing pretty well so I'm not too worried about the rest we will investigate a little bit but remember that warning sign. If you see just a small little leaf of decay coming out of one of your colas, the odds are that there is caterpillar damage there. If you have not sprayed your Bacillus thuringiensis, you likely have live caterpillars doing damage and pooping in your cannabis. And if you get to it early, you can salvage most of everything. And then just keep your eye on everything. Watch how big the buds are getting. And if they're big enough, go ahead and take them if you're seeing some damage. So I'm gonna pull this one over. This one right here, I'm gonna pull over and take a look here. I'm just doing a little bit of investigation here. And seeing what I see making sure because this one was a little far from my sight so it doesn't look too bad it looks like we caught it early I will keep up on my Bacillus thuringiensis spray as well as clean up these ones that did get a little damage so with that guys make sure that you're keeping up on your IPMs 
and your fungicides if needed. And keep happy, stay stoned in Urban Garden.